Hadith 24, The Forbiddance of Oppression On the authority of Abu Dhar al-Ghifari, of the Prophet, peace be upon him, is that among the sayings he relates from his Lord is that he said, O my servants, I have forbidden oppression for myself, and I have made it forbidden amongst you. So do not oppress one another. O my servants, all of you are astray except those whom I have guided. So seek guidance from me, and I shall guide you. O my servants, all of you are hungry, except those whom I have fed. So seek food from me, and I shall feed you. O my servants, all of you are naked, except those whom I have clothed. So seek clothing from me, and I shall clothe you. O my servants, you commit sins by day and night, and I forgive all sins. So seek forgiveness from me, and I shall forgive you. O my servants, you will not attain harming me so as to harm me, and you will not attain benefiting me so as to benefit me. O my servants, if the first of you and the last of you and the humans of you and the jinn of you were all as pious as the most pious heart of any individual amongst you, then this would not increase my kingdom and iota. O my servants, if the first of you and the last of you and the humans of you and the jinn of you were all as wicked as the most wicked heart of any individual amongst you, then this would not decrease my kingdom an iota. O oh, my servants, if the first of you and the last of you, and the humans of you and the jinn of you were all to stand together in one place and ask of me, and I were to give everyone what he requested, then that would not decrease what I possess, except what is decreased of the ocean when a needle is dipped into it. O oh, my servants, it is but your deeds that I account for you and then recompense you for. So he who finds good, let him praise Allah, and he who finds other than that, let him blame no one but himself. Muslim